Hey everybody, welcome to another week here at the Tourloin. The temperatures this week dropped down into the 30s in Fahrenheit and around 0 to 5 degrees uh, Celsius. So it's going to be cold again. Hopefully that's not going to last long. I'm going to be starting next week. I'm going to be on vacation or starting next weekend. So hope we have a little bit nice temperatures. So it's nice to work on here. And what we are doing here this week is we are trying to finish some of the plumbing that is still outstanding. There are still a few things that we have to rearrange. Um, we still have to sh plumb in the shower upstairs and also finish the drains, all the different stacks and pipes that we had to finish from the second floor down into the basement. So the first thing that we need to change is this is where our vanity is in the upstairs bathroom and we have a double vanity over here it will connect the drain right here into the wall but this vent stack when you have the vanity up to for example to this level you're supposed to have the vent not go horizontal until at least a few inches above the level of the sink so therefore in case it overflows, it, it, it plugs right here, right underneath, and the vent also starts filling. It wouldn't have a horizontal line where so debris can then fill up and then uh, clog the vent. So therefore, the vent should always be vertical until the spot, uh, the same level as the basin or whatever appliance that you're using um, has its water level. The same thing has to happen here on this side. Another sink from the laundry room and the water coming over from the washing machine. We have to move these two horizontal vent stacks a little further up because otherwise they could get clogged.
Now that the vent is adjusted to be higher than the level of the washing machine and the sink will ever be, we need to move on to the shower. We need to do, figure out the plumbing over there. One of the reasons why I didn't get too much done this weekend was because I was picking up this cabinet table saw about an hour and a half away on the weekend here. Uh, it was a great find on Facebook. It was pretty cheap for what you're getting here. So pretty happy with this find. It's going to help us when we need to cut all the um, pine wood for the outside. We're going to reside all of it and we want to do it with pine so we're gonna buy rough cut pine dry it and then refinish it and therefore we need to cut it to right size okay now that we have the vent right up here and also over here at the bottom they need to combine so i'm gonna come over straight go through these joists and then combine it up here
since I just ran out of one and a half inch pipe and it is six o'clock Sunday evening I think I'm gonna call it for this week here and I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will see you next time I turn on the camera one thing I am going to be on vacation starting next weekend so <clears throat> I'm not sure yet let me know what you guys think if I should maybe post more than once a week I'll be actually gone uh, I'll be on vacation for almost four weeks so I have a little extra time I'm gonna be working on the house extra so let me know if you prefer me posting more than once a week or just a recap of the entire week and just get more progress done well have a good one see you guys thanks